I've enjoyed it here. It's, it's, it's been fun. It's been a learning progress from process for me. Uh, being a young guy that was undrafted to uh, now I'm just finished up my seventh year. Um, the legacy I've, I've laid down has been pretty good for myself. So the thing is, is uh, we got to see what the business side is about. What's it meant to you to be a Steeler? <clears throat> it's been fun, man. It's been one of those things where you you, you live the dream in a sense. You know, it's this. Um, this program, uh, from my understanding, the guys that come here has been nothing but A1. It's been great for me. Um, a stand-up type of team, man. Even the guys on the team, man, I love them to death. So um, it'll be interesting this offseason. Is today a feeling of goodbye? I don't know. It's, it's, it's weird even uh, thinking of it like that. But the reality is your time got to come to an end, um, whether it's here or whether it's somewhere else or whether you're just done. So um, it's a wait-and-see type of game now. What was, it, what was the cohesion like on the line, you know, with two starters out for, you know, for the season? It was good. The guys that came in, man, fell into a great role. They felt, um, felt like they played well. Um, they did a really good job. I don't think one point in the season we were like, man, if this, if this, and if that. Um, guys just kind of played ball and didn't really give much of a thought to it because you can't dwell on the things you can't change. What do you think Munchie's impact was in all that? Huge, huge. He was a guy that, that kept it. He kept us busy, which is kind of took it away from uh, the focus away from, you know, the guys that were out. And I, I think uh, that was a big part to him and challenging us weekly and um, giving us a, a workload that we can handle. Uh, you know, I still got another year here and I'm happy to be here. Um, you know, the bounce will get back, be healthy and you know, I'll be a good addition to the team and, um, you know, make the offense that much better. Cody, gotcha. How long do you let this sit? I mean, how long does, does the loss like this fester? Yeah, no, it's going to take a while. Um, you know, it's, it's tough. You know, you get in the playoffs and all of a sudden it ends and it's just like that, you know, and you've, you've obviously got hopes to keep going further. So, um, yeah, it's going to sting for a while. Do you look around the locker room and knowing that this is a business, does it start to soak in now that this locker room will look different next year? Yeah, you know, that's kind of the first thing you think of, you know, as soon as the game's over, you look around that locker room and, uh, you know, it's going to be a lot, a lot of different faces next year, but hopefully, you know, not too many and um, we can get back the guys that we need.